Guys, welcome back to Empire Season 2. I just want to start today's video by saying I've been saying the word law a lot. You may have noticed it. I might have been saying law, 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 for example, when law happens. Well, today I've given myself a challenge. I am not allowed to say the word law in this entire video. Not once from when we officially get into the video. So, it's gonna be a bit of a tricky challenge, so I'm gonna get it out of my system right now. La 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 Okay, that's probably enough. Let's get started. Ho, ho, ho. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Empires Season 2. Why did I say ho, ho, ho? Well, it's because I'm a green giant, baby. I've logged in today to find we have some intruders. Who has put this here? Why is this in our fountain? And how many are there? Where did it even come from? I'm so confused. Today, we have big plans like usual, and we've named our empire Stratos. And the reason we've named it Stratos is because we can make the pun Stratosphere if we ever put a sphere in here. And today, that's exactly what we're going to do. And you know, because I've stopped myself from saying that word today, because I've been saying it too much. Well, this sphere is going to tell a story. Create some backstory. Story, 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 story. Not as easy to say. Makes me sad. What have I done to myself? But before we can build our sphere, we need to get some more villagers because these guys, they're pretty helpful. They trade me gold, but there's just not enough of them. I built this lovely little area out of dirt down here. And this is where I'll put some villagers. I've decided. But that's boring. So let's just pretend some storytelling has happened. Now I could tell you a fake story about how it got storied in, not the other word. But in reality, I've spent a long time trading with my villagers in here for all their emeralds. We've got a load more in, as you can see. And then I spent a load of time standing at Fwip's masons, trading with them. I really need to get my own masons. I've just got to wait for them to flock to me and worship me because I'm a god. I'm not imagining things, right? This is canon. Canon story. But what did my three hours of trading get me? Well, let me show you because oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It's honestly the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. It's so beautiful. I love it. I love you so much, Quartz. Marry me, Quartz. Actually, no, you're just a block. I now have to smelt it all. I, I, I think I might actually just make a super smelter quickly. Wait, hang on a second. Dear Thunder Daddy, thank you for your riches. Here's a bouquet of my finest wood. Whenever you think of hard wood, think of Daddy Sausage. <laughs> Available 24 hours just for you. Wow. Okay, let's have a look. Oh my gosh, Sausage. That is insane. How are we going to one-up that? I don't know. I'm just going to leave that there for now. That's crazy. Thank you, Hermes. Thank you for delivering this. Anyway, like I was saying, we're going to build a super smeller, and I think I might be able to fit one in here. It may be a bit tricky, but we'll give it a go. I'll mess around a little bit. We can use some of Daddy Sausage's wood. I found with Empire Season 2, I just constantly need iron. Oh, I'm going to have to go mining. How can we make mining fun? Hmm. I know. A poem. So off I flew using rockets for speed. I found this cave with the iron I need. So I mined some up and killed some mobs and got four stacks, which will do the job. I killed a zombie and then I flew back where there I smelted each of the stacks. Wasn't that lovely? Anyway, here we have some iron, but more importantly in our inventory, we have our hoppers and our minecart hoppers. So let's put a chest in, some hoppers, some furnaces, and then more hoppers, and even more hoppers, and some blocks like so, powered rails, plus some normal rails, redstone block to power the rails, some chests, some hopper minecarts like so, and finally some levers. And if we flick these, off they go. Now, of course, this looks pretty ugly, and I'm hot and sexy, and all my builds need to resemble that, so we're gonna fix this up. We're also gonna fill up with quartz blocks and some fuel to get this stuff smelting. And I'm gonna do a quick transition now of making this look nice by going, whoa! whoa. Oh my gosh, what a crazy transition. That was really smooth. Yeah, look, I've done it, guys. I've done it. Look, we got input, we got fuel, we got the output where, look, we're getting some smooth quartz. We got a load of like spare chests around here just in case. And then we got this sort of little room here where I've actually put a door as I think a bridge up from there would be amazing. Like some sort of way to get to there. Perfect, because then we can get to the super smelter super easily. Super, super, super. Seeing as I can't repeat that one word, I've been repeating a lot of other words. Please, guys, please let me say it more. I need it in my life. But anyway, now that's all smelting and good, let's transition to a segment I like to call 
messing with the law. And the law is spelt L-A-W, not the one I'm not allowed to say, so I can say this one. So I currently have this head cannon. That young Jimmy, who's AFK by the way, is Woody from Toy Story. And in my head, he doesn't know he's a toy. So my goal this season is to make sure he realizes that he is a toy. So let's head over to the Mesa right now. So I'm just going to build something on this hill here real quick. You may be able to guess what it is from the blocks, but you may not. Just looking into Jimmy's kingdom down here. Looking really nice. Looking really good. Uh, we shame someone placed this here. It's so I tried to build it small and it looks really ugly. It looks like something from build battle from ages ago. But I've put a sign saying, hi, Jimmy, you saved our life. We are eternally grateful. So hopefully he'll see that next time he logs in. Probably won't be too happy about it, but he says we're enemies and I, I feel like I've just got to prod him a little bit to make him hate me even more. Quick side note, all you amazing artists out there doing fan art like all the ones you're seeing on the screen now, I have a prompt for you. Me holding Jimmy in the air, pulling his cord on his back. Make him say funny lines as well. I don't know what they can be, but anything. Thanks for watching the segment, Messing With The Law. I'm above the law, quite literally in height and in where I've built. And in the actual meaning of it, because I am a god. But anyway, back to working what we're actually meant to be working on today, and that is the stratosphere. First, we need to make a bridge over to it. So let's do that, shall we? Guys, say what you want about me, but one thing's clear. I do not lie. I say, let's go do that, and now we're going to do that. Look, I am doing that. I am building a bridge, and it's got lots of gold in it, because I'm going to build with gold more now. And that is because I love gold. It is the best block in the game. I I I'm kind of getting a bit obsessed with it. But luckily, I have lots of it because of my gold farm. But look, there's the bridge with a big dirt tower. Oh my gosh, get rid of that, Joel. But anyway, there's the bridge without the dirt tower, and it looks so much better. Nice. But where's it leading? Ooh, well, I've already told you, so I don't know why I'm pretending like I haven't. I'm an idiot. Yes, it's going to lead to the stratosphere, and for the stratosphere, we need a lot of blocks. Did you really think I was going to build a small sphere? No, 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 no. It's going to be big. Sorry, my material gathering montages, you've heard poems, you've heard me dance. Wait, did I say heard me dance? You've seen me dance. I've spoken a different language, but have you heard me sing? I will sing each of the material's names, but nothing else. And after this is done, you'll be saying, Joel, please never sing again. So first I organized my quartz, and I also made some chiseled quartz. I then went and collected myself some gold, and also some sap. And, which, by the way, I removed the disallowed word and put God instead. I then collected some calcite <laughs> and put on the sand to smelt. I then stripped some warped wood. By the way, I'm hating this as much as you're probably hating this. I then went and collected some copper and put it on to smelt as well. <laughs> oh, and I also collected myself some azalean leaves. Yeah. <laughs> and spaced out my copper. I've already done that one. Crafted some cyan stained glass and also got some cyan wool to make some banners. <laughs> I then collected some mass blocks to make some massy cobblestone. And then I went and got some waxed weather cut cup slabs. And then I went to the nether. Then I got some warped warp blocks and some glow berries and went to the end to get myself some end rods. Oh my gosh. <sighs> I need to breathe. I need to breathe. All right, let's stop that right there. That is more than enough of that. I apologize so much. So, so much for that. So, here's my apology. We're going to build a sphere. The stratosphere. And we've got all these materials here. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Lovely. Lots of materials. It's going to be a big build. And it's going to be spherical. I hope you like it. Time lapse, Joel. Take it away with that time lapse stuff you do where you speed up the building. Oh, I will, Joel. I'm an idiot. And I speak like this. Haha, <laughs> you do. Take it away. What the heck? Other Joel is so mean. Anyway, I'm here building my nice sphere and I don't sound like this. I sound like this. And look, it's a sphere which is kind of split in half. We've got a sort of colorful bit underneath and then we've got this dome roof on the top using some glass, some cyan glass and some like other stuff as well. And I'm not entirely sure what we're going to put in this yet other than one thing I do exactly have in mind, which you will see in a second. We're going to add it in afterwards. It's not fully complete yet, but as you can see, it's looking nice. But here it is, the sphere, the stratosphere, or the stratos Sophia, as Jimmy would call it. 
Now it is looking a bit bare inside, and I do have some idea of what I want to do with this. I might get some animals up here. Like, I want to get some frogs around the pond, decorate the pond a little bit. So we'll go do that in a second, but first... I want to place something in. This here will be the most precious thing in all of my empire. Because although this could be the stratosphere, it's not the real stratosphere. This right here, what I'm building right now, is the real stratosphere. Made of pure gold. It's going to be thick all the way through. I will never use this gold for anything. I will never mine this gold. It's going to stay here forever. And I'm a block shot. How, how have I done that? There we go. So this is the true stratosphere right there. Look at it. It's beautiful. It's so gold. It's shiny. It's dense. It's mine. So people worship me. I worship the stratosphere up there. It's the most precious thing in the world. But the second most precious thing in the world to me is little Hermes here. And we need to drop him off at his other dad. So I buy sausages fountain over here, which by the way, this place is looking insane. I put Hermes here holding a little bucket with an axolotl in it. The axolotl is yellow. Gold, you may say. A golden axolotl. And it's got a weird name. You'll have to find out what it is in Sausage's video. I've put, hi daddy. Other daddy loved your hard word. It made him very pleased. He asked me to bring you a new friend. He comes from deep down, but he wants to stay with you. So there you go. The axolotl. Let's hope we've got enough rockets to get back. On my way back, we're going through the mangrove swamp here. Let's see if there's any frog spawn around. Wait, do you have to breed up the frogs to get frog spawn? I can't remember. I think I need a slime ball. Well, luckily slime spawn in the swamp, so I'll just wait here. Die! No, stop shooting it, skeletons. I want the slime. Oh, gosh. Mangrove swamps are honestly horrible. I only got three! Alright, my bed's just been exploded by a creeper. Shovel, I'm borrowing your house. I finally found two frogs in the same place. This has taken me about ten minutes. Let's see if we can breed them. Come on, guys. Nice. Which one's going to have the frog spawn? Seems like neither of them. Good. And now I've only got one slime ball. Okay. Take two. Come on, guys. Come over here. All right. Bam. Bam. Give me some blooming frog spawn. <gasps> yes. Okay. Finally. Wait. How would you pick this up? No! I am so angry. I am so angry right now. I've realized I'm an idiot and I need to collect the tadpoles, not the frog spawn. So, oops. Oh, I need to head home. Oh, I've got no rockets. I'm back with my looting sword and rockets. Let's wait for it to turn nighttime and then we can kill some slimes. I've actually just found some slimes, guys. And I definitely didn't steal it from Shelby. Because I was impatient. So Shelby asks, I didn't steal it, okay? I didn't, I promise. All right, frog friends. I want your tadpoles. Go, go, go. Yeah, baby. All right, now we wait. Oh, they, they've spawned. Off they go. Get in my bucket. Get in my bucket. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm glad I did that without having to steal any slime. Let's head home. I'm going to change his name to Frog with two Gs. Why? I don't know. And we're going to put him down in the stratosphere. Enjoy, Frog. Now, it's time we upgrade ourselves a little bit, I think. And... To upgrade ourselves, we have to craft something, and that is the essence of the gods. And now we can do some storytelling by throwing this and my wings in the pond. Let's do it. Bam. Bam. And look. <gasps> wow. Look at this. Wings to match a god. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at these. These look so cool. Woo. Lovely. So there you have it, guys. That is all we have got time for for today's episode. Look at our empire. Oh, my gosh. It's growing. It's getting bigger. It's looking rather nice with all these bridges. Imagine in the future just bridges everywhere. I'm going to add in some trees and stuff as well. It's going to be beautiful. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. Make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe if you're new. And I shall see you another time. Good. Bye.